um, I'd like to ask the Minister for Infrastructure what plans he has to empower local authorities to set speed limits in their areas. Well, the Minister to reply. Thank you, Mr. President. The Department has powers to introduce and revise speed limits under the Road Traffic Regulation Act 1985. There is no provision with this, within this Act to delegate this function to local authorities. And indeed, the Act is specific to the, that the Department alone is responsible for making speed limit orders. Local authorities are consulted as part of the process of setting speed limits through regular meetings of the Traffic Management Liaison Groups, which includes Department officers, representatives of local authorities and representatives from the police. The need to work with the Road Safety Partnership is of significance to improve road safety for all users. Uh, thank you, Mr. President. I'm grateful for the um, Minister's response, and it's heartening to hear that local uh, input is uh, taken into account. Um, in neighbouring countries, uh, local authorities have been given the responsibility to set speed limits for their communities, and this has delivered positive outcomes. Does he feel that this practice would also be effective on our island? Minister. Thank you, Mr. President. I think um, the key thing here is obviously legislation at the moment doesn't allow us to do that. Um, you know, obviously, that, that's something that could be considered. I think the main piece, actually, the, the thrust of what we need to do is through the Road Safety Partnership, and I'd be, I'm really looking forward to the, uh, hopefully the Road Safety uh, Strategy coming into Timwell shortly and working together, because that is the thrust of evidence-based uh, data-driven um, analysis to actually determine those areas that uh, you know do need speed limits, and that we can do it on, on, on analytical data and evidence base. And the local authorities' feedback and experiences will be critical to that. Final supplementary, Mr. Shimmons. Uh, thank you, Mr. President. And again, uh, I, I welcome the minister's uh, comments on this matter. Does, does he recognise that many local people are very unhappy with speeding? in their areas, and to date they have been frustrated with the response that they have received when they have raised these issues with his department. How will he meaningfully address this frustration, which directly impacts on many local residents' quality of life? Thank you, and I think the really key part of this is going to be the road safety a strategy that we will work with the Department of Home Affairs with, and I think the key key basis of this is going to be evidence and uh, based and data and collection and working with all those residents. And I think we'll get much better outcomes and much more um, because the, the the strategy will be around actually de delivering uh, real change and, and reductions in injuries and, and so forth. Um, I, I'm very I'm I'm confident that that strategy can actually deliver real change and real <laughs> benefits.